and our law enforcement heroes. As you heard, running towards that theater, even as there were sound of gunshots, potentially saving additional lives. I want to emphasize the gunman's original plan was to leave the theater alive. His car was parked at the exit. He, as he was leaving in the crowd, trying to mingle in the crowd, he saw the law enforcement, local police officers, went back inside. That's when he shot and killed himself. Look, this was an awful, awful night for Lafayette, for Louisiana, for our entire country. There were amazing acts of heroism and selflessness that happened inside that theater. I think we're going to hear more of those as we continue to talk to witnesses and talk to those that were injured. Uh, a couple that I heard from last night as I went to the local hospital, two teachers here on summer break wanted to come see one final movie, come see a comedy as they were getting ready for school to start again. One teacher literally jumping over her friend, potentially saving her life. Second teacher thought that felt like that bullet would have hit her in the head if her friend hadn't jumped on her. The second teacher was shot anyway in the leg, had the presence of mind to pull that fire alarm. Who knows how many lives were saved just by that presence of mind. And I think we're gonna hear more and more stories like this where friends were looking out for each other.